Hi, so this is one of those moments where having an open heart, open mind, open eyes really comes full circle. In this case, um, this instance, it brought forth um, knowledge of both good and evil. Yeah, so uh, this is pretty rocking. I'm here at Samoa Beach. I believe it's Samoa. And I just kind of need to take the time to really connect with myself, reconnect with myself, reconnect with my heart. And, you know, there's something really magical about the way that the ocean has a way of doing that. Something about sand just like flowing through beach, through bare toes and seashells, just lying abundantly in the sand, finding them. You know? Reminding me that there's life everywhere and that essentially we're never alone. We may think that we are, we may feel that we are, but we're not. There's birds. There's cats, there's dogs, there's fish, there's roosters, there's so many different things just in existence. And it's kind of silly for us to say, I want to be alone. But definitely it's those perceived moments, those moments that we think we're alone, that we feel that there's nobody around us, that we that we have that inside us, that sentiment that 
No one's here to listen. You know, it's in those moments that we really, that we really fully grow. Those silence, those moments of silence. And so today I'm just taking a moment of silence. A shared moment of silence. Knowing that Knowing that we're moving towards a more perfect vision of ourselves, that we're piecing ourselves together, reconnecting with those old parts, pieces that we forgot the pieces that we don't choose to show, the parts of ourselves that we neglect. They are so important to us. And it's really when we can confront those, we can greet those, we can just open our, uh, our hearts our heads, our minds, open our arms. And greet that discomfort, that sense of dis-ease, that unwillingness to look straight into the sun with eyes closed. We can do it. You know? We can. And it really is just a matter of when. 